Welcome to, I just tried to do something totally different. I was online a little while ago. I had this crazy urge to do a cook. Yeah, something unhealthy. Yeah, something simple. Yeah. And this is the crock pot I'm going to be cooking some unhealthy stuff in. It's really easy. I'm going to try, if this actually works, I'm going to try some really cool unhealthy recipes. And that, I have a grandmother recipe that's really unhealthy, really cool. But I'm going to do that another time. I'm just going to start off simple. This thing, I don't know, this recorder doesn't have a pause button. It's my first time trying this, so let's see how this goes. I am cooking da-da-da-da. It's going to be Little Smokies. Here is the kitchen I'm going to do it in. And just kind of a look. I just had my carpets cleaned today, so... Oh, there's the cat dish. And so, yeah, everything is like stacked on walls. My wireless went down, so like a, there's an internet cable going to the the laptop in the room and well here's a look at the place whoa random TV channel and here's what a look outside it's night this is late nighttime cooking and I just wanted to give a heads up to the cat what's up she had a rough day there was things moving around and and things and she is I'm sure tired what's up kitty cat she's cool she is a nice cat she likes She's a head cat. She likes it there. All right, so and go back to sleep, relax, enjoy. And a lot of times when she's awake, I just kind of, here's the window or whatever, I kind of crack it open for her. So, and then I don't think she wants to go outside right now, but it's nighttime. There's no buggies. Okay, sort of a thing of the living room. Yeah, things are stacked against walls right now. Hey, I recognize that picture. And the TV's all a mess. This was on sale today. I've seen a few of the Clone War things. I don't know if I'm a huge fan or not, but it was on sale all five seasons, so I decided to get it. It's 40 hours of stuff that I haven't really seen. I've seen ones here and there. It was kind of on sale, so I figured, what the heck? It's like a boxed edition sort of collector set. Anyways, I'm here. Oh, it's, uh, okay, that's a, kind of a mess. This place is a mess. I had to clean the carpets, like I said, and they're clean. Just stuff has to go back where it went. So, we're cooking Little Smokies. Let's check this out. Whoa, the refrigerator is kind of a mess too. There's the beer. Beer! I don't think I'm going to have any tonight, but maybe I'll have one while I'm cooking this stuff. Let's see here. Here's some lunch meat for the week. Unhealthy ham. All right. And um, you know what? This is tomorrow's specialty. It's going to be hamburgers. Yeah! I don't know if I'll record that or not. I have no idea. I'm going to grill those babies up. Or something. So anyways, this is a really simple, unhealthy, unhealthy meal. It's beef Little Smokies. It's really easy because they're already cooked. You can totally microwave these. Um, you know, save you time or whatever. But I think it's cool to put them in a crock pot. This was my grandmother's crock pot. I still have it. I like using the thing. And so we're going to basically put these bad boys into this thing. And do a slow... Like a low cook. You can cook them high, medium, low. I'm going to start off low. At some point, I'll put to warm and then high when I'm ready to eat these things. It kind of takes like an hour to make, 45 minutes, whatever. Whatever you want. And they can kind of simmer all night. So what we're going to need... Oh, here's a well, here's the oven. I have some kind of spice rack here. It's kind of... Everything's moved around right now because I just had this place cleaned up. I renewed this apartment for another year, so I am here another year, yay! So the place feels like a new place. Just had to get everything off the floor and stuff. So a lot of times you use, well, I like to use barbecue sauce for these things. But I do have something probably in this cupboard pantry thing. I don't even know what's up here, honestly. There's other barbecue sauce. There's cup of noodle soup, Ziploc bags, whatever. There's bullseye. That's nice. Memphis. It's a good one. It's okay. It's cheap, whatever, it's fine. Um, there's some soups and stuff. I'm thinking, I just, I'm just in the mood for a Stater Brothers regular barbecue sauce this time. There's other sauces that are better, but this is good. I need to kind of use it up. Whoa, it's a marinara sauce. You know what, let's take a look and, wasn't going to do this, but let's take a look in the drawers. All right, there's full stuff. A coffee, I started make, making coffee before Christmas. I found a coffee maker on sale, so I've been having all that coffee. And there's some soups. 
saran wrap, I don't know, water. <laughs> Here's just what's in the cupboard right now. Which is cool, macaroni and cheese, mac and cheese. It's good. Some Hunt's tomato sauce for another meal that I might make. That's There's a real, time, if, if, if you want a meaty meal, which I might record, it's my parents' recipe. It works like a charm. You just, it, it's called hot dish. I might go into that later. It's a money saver. It's meat. It's lots of leftovers. It's frozen food. It's good. Cataranch chili. The best chili around. You can get that at Costco only that I know of. Some rice. And I don't even know what the heck is down here. Some more cattle ranch. Popcorn! More unhealthy food. Yeah! So, I'm taking this Stater Brother hot sauce. Barbecue sauce, not hot sauce. Oh, the kitty's back. Hey, kitty. Hey, what's up? I'm going to have to feed her again. I fed her some... There she is. <laughs> she's... Everything's been moved around. She's, she's kind of curious, so she's going into the room. And that's good. So... We're going to put that barbecue sauce down. we got to open these bad boys. So basically, it's really, really simple. It's really, really fun. Oh, you know what? We need a spoon. We need a spoon. We're going to go in here. It doesn't matter. I like to use, like, a plastic spoon. It's good. Hey, there's a time of night. It's 10.09. This is late night stack, Saturday night. Okay, so, <laughs> yeah, I had a really busy day today. So, anyways, oh, I got our cat food stacked up against the wall. So basically, well, here's a cupboard with some plates. I have to do dishes and things. It doesn't matter. I just like to use a small plate, put the spoon on, because this does involve some stirring. So crap, here we go. Let's see here. I don't know what to do. Is this? I might have to put the camera down for this part. I need someone to help me hold the camera phone. So here's obviously the top lid. We're going to take that off. Okay. Here's the cat food. She likes seafood sensations. That's her wet food of choice. So cool. That's what she likes. That's what she gets. So we're going to open these bad boys. You can use scissors. Doesn't matter. You could probably peel it if you want to. Oh, oh the kitty cat. What's up, kitty? And she's happy. Here she goes. <laughs> cooking with a... Uh... With uh, cooking some unhealthy food. The cat does not like beef products at all. And I do let her go outside. She's a scaredy cat. She runs inside a lot. And <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> this is cool. That's her little way out. She gets scared. She runs back in. Given the choice, I don't know if she's going to go out. It's nighttime. Go. So, let's see here. Well, I guess you're getting a look at the place. I'm probably going to move that chair and take some of the stuff that's down there that I had to kind of put up and outside and wherever it went. Probably put it over here. I'm going to do something with this section of the room. I don't know. Oh, there's some DVD stuff. Cool. I got my shirt. Like I said, I had to hang up stuff and put things in corners to get this done. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Here's my dad's Bible when he was a kid. Okay, I wasn't going to put that up, but I still have it. Okay, I think it was like 1957 or something. Okay, so let's go to what I was going to do. I got totally sidetracked. Yeah, we're going to have some Little Smokies. Yeah, here's a knife collection. All right, doesn't matter which knife. I don't know, this one, I've had this one quite a while just for cooking stuff. It's a good knife. I'm going to wash the dishes tomorrow anyway because the dishwasher is like kind of full of stuff. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open this thing. i got to put the camera down. So enjoy, you get to look at <laughs> Probably nothing. This is gonna fall out. You get to look at Stater Brothers thing. Listen to my voice. I'm gonna cut this bad boy open, which is not that hard to do. You can use a butter knife. You don't have to use a sharp knife. But I'm washing dishes tomorrow, anyways. So, you know, whatever. Okay. These bad boys are open. So here is. The Little Smokies, they are open. What we're gonna do is put them in here. We need to open this this bottle too, so. Where else I put this, okay, you can look at, you can look at nothing for a little bit, but the crock pot. I'm opening up, I need like a tripod for a camera or <laughs> something. But this is just for fun, so who cares? So I'm opening up, as you can hear it, the barbecue sauce. All right, cool. So the barbecue sauce is open. You can use one or two bottles. 
it's no big deal. I found that one works fine, which is one package. If you're doing a party, sometimes I do this at work occasionally and other places, you know, you could put in two of these packages and two or three of these barbecue sauces. A couple works. And it, they're good. What you do to make them good at parties and stuff. And I'm just, I'm not going <laughs> to record the party one. But what I like to do when I do those, you know, or when I go to them or have one, is there's little toothpicks. And you just kind of, you know, you just kind of, you know, with toothpicks, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. You can fork it and stuff, but that just makes it really, really cool. I like it. So, how am I going to do this with a, with, well, I'm going to do this with one hand. Here are the little Smokies. Really, really simple dish. There's other cool, unhealthy crap I might cook later. You put that crap in there. Yeah, this is unhealthy. You don't do this all the time. I should have checked the date on these boys. Okay, it does say February 4th. It's like January, I don't know what it is. There's a calendar on the wall. It's like January 21st or 19th. Everything is hanging up on the wall. Well, whatever. It's not February yet. Good enough with me. And what you do is you put them in the bowl, which I just did. Toss out the pack. And you can put in barbecue sauce. Doesn't that look yummy? <laughs> it actually tastes pretty good. Um, I would do two, but I'm just going to do one because it's really all you need. So, I used to do two all the time, but then you're, you're just tossing out so much sauce. I found out one is good. So, we'll empty that bad boy in there. Fucking smells good, too. So, okay. There goes the barbecue sauce. So, what you do, this is, you just, this is really simple. You just put it on low. You can put it on warm. I put it on low. Uh, do I have it plugged in? I have it plugged in. I, okay, I have a coffee maker. I'm going to get like a three-way plug. This is the phone, the charger to my phone. And this cord goes, oh, I started drinking coffee at home. Work coffee is awful. And so here's the coffee maker. It's perfect. It makes about three to four cups. Not too much, not too little, just right. And if I want more, I can always make more. I've been taking that to work every day. Cool. So let's see here. And on weekends, have some. And well, I turned it on. What you do is you just basically stir once in a while. Pretty simple, huh? And they taste fucking good. And so, you know, as it gets high and higher, you, you know, when it starts steaming, it gets warmer because I don't know if this video is going to pause and I don't know if I'm going to mess with it any too much more. Or maybe I'll load a two-parter when it's closer to done. But you just stir, you know. And then what you do, which helps, is you put it on the lid. Pretty simple, huh? And in about 20 minutes to half hour, I put it on warm. And you keep stirring. You know, I'm going to put it on warm. It's a little bit late. I'm going to put it on warm early. And when you feel like eating, you turn, you turn up the juice and put it on high. And that's how you crock pot it. Pretty simple. They're pre-cooked. You can microwave them in just a few minutes. It's easy to. But that's how I like to do it. So there is how to make little smokies. And just you have a little... Just, it's good to stir them with a spoon or whatever. It's what I like to do. Since we're at this, let's go into the room. Forgive the cable. My wireless went down, so... Everything's moved around. The laptop's in a different spot, sort of. Here's sort of the room. Ah, oh, the bed. Okay, whoa, the bed. I have to, I have to put sheets on there. I just tore this whole place apart oh well here's a room in the tv or tv in the bedroom there we go there's an old clock i had a while an xbox 360 playstation 2 i have some sega things somewhere and other stuff like in the other room and oh i'm gonna have some chips and guacamole pretty soon more eating unhealthy food that's right some chips i saw them at albertson's today had to grab them I was in the mood. I was. I had to go somewhere in between getting my truck maintained, maintenance today, and long story, carpets cleaned, and long, long day. And here is, I had to put all this stuff on the on the desk. I have to rearrange. But here's the laptops, I think. Well, I know I was playing Lord of the Rings online. Okay, cool. <laughs> if anybody cares. Here's a nighttime view of the bedroom. It's actually warm. It's January and it's warm. It's like 
warm still. I can't believe it. So here's like a nighttime view. The moon's out. Pretty cool. And I don't know. It's not a bad little apartment. Here's some cars that are parked kind of nearby. It's pretty quiet most of the time. It's pretty chill most of the time. And there we go. And what? What else we got here? Oh, you know what? When I'm doing the Let's Plays or whatever, I recently bought this. It was before Christmas. It was around Thanksgiving time. I can't quite remember when. I just kind of saw my parents for the day, and I was looking through mics. I went to this computer store that's in Tustin. It's called Micro Center. Not a one-of-a-kind store, but you don't see them everywhere. But they have really cool stuff. Oh, the kitty is back. Kitty! She's back. She's returned. She likes being near me a lot. So, let's see here. But anyway, this Blue Bomb mic, I was recording with a headset. Like, I was getting tired of it. The computer microphone gave me a bunch of crackling noises. She's investigating new changes because I moved a back of computer over there. And here's the monitor to it. But this Blue Bomb mic is cool. It was nice. I like the buy. I can actually play, record, talk into TeamSpeak when I'm in the mood and without a headset. And the game, like, dubs in. It's cool. Okay, I don't want it to log me off. So anyways, that is cooking unhealthy. I like it. And so what you do, there's a tour of this place. And what you have to remember to do, of course, throw your stuff out. But all you have to remember to do, see, it's starting to get warm already. All you have to remember to do is just take the lid off once in a while. I cleaned this a little bit ago. And stir. So it doesn't get too burned or sticky or whatever and you just kind of do it whenever you want it's really really simple i will probably do more complicated unhealthy meals unhealthy crap stuff not to do often but it tastes so good you do it anyways probably in the future so hope you enjoyed it and the kitty is back kitty is our friend anyways take care <laughs> have a good time <laughs> i didn't know this cat's gonna be hanging around me during the recording and you can see she has food. I'll probably get her some more dry food. It's wet food. There's She's going to eat it. K eating with a kitty. She's not going to eat it. She's exploring the new changes because I had to move stuff around. Exploring with a kitty. Okay, anyways. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care. See each other soon. I'm not sure if I'm going to put this with the second part or not because this thing cannot pause. So I might have to go back to an old video camera that uses videotape to do it. Anyways. Take care, hope you enjoyed it, and hope you like the cat, it's cool, and goodbye.